Hello, my name is Christina Lynn Category, and I am a student pharmacist at UT Tyler. Today, I will be talking to you about theophylline, also known as lexophylline, theo24, and theochron. So this is a bronchodilator, and it is used to treat breathing problems, symptoms of asthma, as well as lung problems. So it is important to remember that this drug is not used to treat intense flare-ups or shortness of breath, and you would need an inhaler for that one in which you would need to speak to your doctor. And to use this medication, you can take it with or without a meal, but it is best taken with a meal and you'd need to take it the same way each time. And it's also important to remember that you do not change doses unless specified by your doctor. And also to not use St. John's wort, which is an herbal medicine while you're on this medication. And if you miss a dose, take it as soon as possible. But if you are closer to your next scheduled dose, then skip the dose that you missed and just continue on with your schedule. And some side effects that can occur are allergic reactions, such as swelling, blistering or peeling of the skin, difficulty breathing and hives, as well as constant headache, uneven heartbeat or fast heartbeats as well, trouble sleeping, seizures. So it's important to call your doctor if you do run a fever because the illness can change how much medication that you need. So your doctor won't make you take too much of the medication, but it is important to remember that you do not change the doses unless your doctor tells you to. And also tell the doctor if you do run symptoms in between the times that you're taking the medication and to stop taking this medication if you have intense flare-ups that come up with it. So you'd need to speak to your doctor for any alternative medicine that you can take. And you'd also need to tell your healthcare provider before taking this medication if you are pregnant or breastfeeding, as well as if you have a stomach ulcer, seizures, heart rhythm problems, or liver and kidney disease, as well as nervous system or thyroid problems. And also tell them if you smoke or if you have a diet, such as eating cooked beef over charcoal every day. And to store your medication, you would need to store it at room temperature in a dry place. So meaning don't store it in your bathroom cabinet and protect it from moisture and light. That is all for today. Thank you so much for listening.